You may have noticed I'm at her streaming station, and I'm hanging out with my HyperX family. The whole gang's here. So it comes down to this question. Are you in love with your HyperX Cloud 2s, but you're looking to up your sound game? Well, I'm proud to introduce to you the newest member of the family for HyperX. You guys ready for this? <laughs> Introducing the HyperX Quadcast. It was shown off initially at CS 2019, and it looked good. And with it sitting here, it looks even better. The Quadcast is sleek, as we've come to expect from HyperX products. We have our HyperX keyboard, we got our mouse, and our headset, and the mic fits right in. Like a long lost brother that was at war for many years. Just comes home. The Quadcast comes right out of the box, ready for gaming or streaming. The mic is already in the shock mount and attached to the hefty base with grips on the bottom, so the mic stays put. Get a few slaps there. Looking good. You can adjust the angle of the mic, so you're hitting that audio sweet spot. Like so. And we have a very long USB braided cable, so it's always good for cable management and keeping you on point with that. Another thing you guys are going to notice here is the really cool honeycomb, uh, I'm going to call it honeycomb flavor we're getting here with the, the red accents from HyperX. On the top, we have the mute button here for some touchy-feely plastic is there so you can kind of know when you're on there. And towards the bottom, we have the HyperX logo. Uh, you'll see here as well, there's some touchy-feely feedback here with an arrow pointing down. This is going to be known as the knob for your game and game control. You can take it out of the shock mount if you had to for good reason. We also have this in the box. It's gonna do a little flip here for you guys. A mount adapter for the mic arm. You'll have more control over placement with the mic arm. Located on the back of the mic, we have the mic pattern control. Stereo, omnidirectional, and everyone's favorite, the cardioid pattern. And last but not least, we have the bi-directional mic pattern for when you have two people talking. Below we have the audio jack to monitor your sound and the USB type A for power. So let's play around with the game control. You'll see here how we have the dot showing right now on our high to low gain. Now, you can turn the knobs past the dots, but that does not affect the gain in the past dots there. So if we're just on one there, it stays one. It's not going to go any lower than that. Or two, three, four, five. But going beyond five does not. Now, I've saved the best for last. The mute button. When you press this bad boy, the LED light goes out. You'll have very clear visual when your mic is muted. This will help with the accidental muting, or even worse, unmuting when things shouldn't be heard, like when you're dropping some hacks, fricks, or even... Uh, we spent most of the video recording on this board. So let us know what you think below. And if you'll be adding the quadcast to your HyperX family, I'd like to know, especially if you're gonna be coming down to Memory Express and... Now, what I said there does not matter. <laughs> Good old mute button, saving my... Anyway, uh, you guys know where to find us on social media. Facebook and Twitter are the same at Memory Express, Instagram official Memory Express, and thank you get Azus Rock for the prize for this month. That's right, you guys know all about MEXP. Comment on all the videos for March. You guys are entering for a fantastic draw for Azus Rock for PSU 850 Watt Platinum Plus. All right, guys, I'm Steve for Memory Express. I will see you later this week. Bow! Now, I've saved the best for last, the mute button. When you press this bad boy, the LED goes out. Ha <laughs> ha!